Hey guys, welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Today we'll be doing a drag build and tune for this 2015 Audi RS6 Avant. So if you enjoy the video or find it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Alright, so first we'll bring our Audi RS6 up to the Festal drag strip so we can see how fast it is by the speed trap at the end. So pulling up to the line here, we're gonna rev this car to 5,000 RPM. Launch here with no wheel spin at all. Fourth, now fifth, and we cross the line at 270 kilometers an hour. All right, so now we're gonna take the RS6 into the festival drag strip race. So we can see how fast it is against other cars as well as get a time by the end. So coming up to the launch here, we're already first. Destroyed everyone else on launch. Into fifth now, no one is even close to us. We won that easily and we got a time of 8.4 seconds. Alright, so now that we've seen just how fast our Audi RS6 is, we'll now take it into the festival and I'll show you how to upgrade and tune it. Alright, so if we bring our stock Audi RS6 into the custom upgrade menu here, first we're going to come down to the conversions tab at the end and into engine swap, and here we'll be putting in the 5.2 litre V10. Then we'll also be doing the twin turbos as well. So out of conversions, now into tyres and rims here, we'll put on the drag tyre compound as well as making the front and rear tyres as wide as possible. Then we'll throw on some lighter weight rims, just going to chuck those on to save 17 kilos and we'll put on wheel spaces as well in the front and rear. So out of tyres and rims, we'll now come into drivetrain to max out everything in here, so a race clutch, race transmission, race driveline, and the race diff. Back out of drivetrain and into platform and handling. Here we'll be putting on the rally springs, then race front and rear anti-roll bars, and the race weight reduction. Then out of platform and handling to engine, and we'll be doing the race intake, race fuel system, race ignition, race exhaust, race valves, race engine block, race twin turbos, race intercooler, and finally the race flywheel. So that's it as far as the upgrades go, so you can go ahead and apply all of these. Right guys, so now that we've upgraded our car, we can come down to the tuning menu here. So first I'll show you the metric tune and then I'll show you the differences for the imperial tune and I'll leave the tune code on screen now. So for the tire pressures, we're gonna set these down to 1.0 bar, just like this. Then next, if we come over to gearing, we're gonna set our final drive to 3.00. Then first gear, we'll bring this up to 5.05. Second gear, we're going to set this to 3.28. Third, we'll set to 2.22. Fourth, we'll go to 1.76. And fifth, we'll set to 1.35. So now if we come over to the alignment, we're going to set our front and rear camber angles to zero degrees. And the front cast angle, we're going to set to seven degrees. Then if we come over to the springs tab in the front, we're gonna set this to 76.5. Come a little bit up to there. There's 76.5. And in the rear, we're gonna set this down to 44.0. Down to there. And next, if we come over to the dampening, we're gonna set our front rebound stiffness to 5.2. And then the rear we can leave as is. And for the front bump stiffness, we're gonna set this to 4.7. So next, if we come over to the differential tab at the end, we're gonna set our front acceleration to 85%, just like that. And in the rear, we're gonna set this to 92%. 
And finally, the centre balance, we're going to set this to 78%. So that's it as far as the metric tune goes. Now I'll show you the differences for the Imperial tune. So as far as differences go for the Imperial tune is you'll want 15 PSI in both the front and rear tyres. Then if you come over to the Springs tab, you'll want 428 in the front and 246 in the rear. So that's it as far as differences go. So you can go ahead and apply all of these. Alright guys, so this has been a drag build and tune for the 2015 Audi RS6 Avant. So if you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe.